I've been doing this myself. Counting Plano helpers, I've been doing this eight, almost nine years. I started volunteering with Frisco Helpers because it's what I've been doing probably my whole life. We've got about 20, about 20 volunteers that are active. We're all in our late 60s, 70s, and a couple of guys in their 80s. We provide uh, small home repairs. We replace light bulbs, we replace smoke detectors, we change the smoke detector batteries, air filters. We do a lot of leaky toilets, leaky faucets. Today, at this client's home, we're gonna be installing at least six grab bars. Grab bars are a necessary feature on almost every person that's senior. So we are both um, seniors and are on fixed incomes and we both had to stop working a little sooner than we expected. So being able to have Frisco helpers, um, volunteers here and not have to pay ginormous contractor fees is so helpful with our monthly budget. They follow the ADA recommendations and every step along the way, they've been so friendly and so helpful and just explain what they're doing as they do it. When we come to a client's home, in a lot of times, it is socialization. We learn about their life and they learn about us and it makes them feel better and it makes us feel better to know that we're helping somebody. We want to tell the senior source, thank you so very much for coordinating the Frisco Helpers and getting those volunteers out here. It means so much to me and to my husband. The reason we volunteer is we all come from a time when you helped your neighbor and they helped you. It gives you something to do and it gives you a sense of accomplishment to go into these people's homes and help and fix things for them.